Hello everyone, this is Mimi from Mimi's Crafty Shop and I have some more things that I've been working on for my Etsy store that I wanted to share. Um, these are two small little journals I made from bags and then I have some bags that go with it, uh, with them, a glassing bag. Um, this goes with this kit and this goes with this kit. So um, let's get started. I'm gonna show the small stuff first. There's, this is a glassing bag that I just made got the idea from Lori, Girl on the Ridge. Um, she made me a beautiful glassing bag and I was just like going, okay, I am going to make some of these. So I got my Mod Podge out, my napkins, my stamps, and my Tim Holtz just went to town on a whole bunch of them. So got them made. Here's some beautiful uh, ephemera and cards. You can journal on the back. These two really beautiful pictures of these ladies. Just their, I call them ladies and their accessories. It's their beautiful flowers. So these will be going with this too. And then I have two napkins that I'm going to send because that way you can do your own Mod Podge. And I mean, like me, I, I learn from other people. So that's kind of my idea is I always want people to learn from me. And this right here, I actually got the um, idea from G uh, Kerr, Happiness and Crafting. She made me one of these. Um, I just recently bought a file photo from her. So I got the idea from her and she always has the best tutorials. So you need to check her out. I got caught up in my sewing. So it's just a little envelope that I made using file folder. Hope I'm in frame. I think I am. Yeah and um, just sewed it and I you know, made me a little um, template so I could have this from now on. Just did some stamping, here's some washi tape, did a little, uh, used some of that spray ink on there and kind of did it up a little vintage. Just added some lace and some appliques, put this little um, bling on there, a little charm and I thought this lady, I, I really did her up really, really vintage looking. More washi tape right here that I recently got. And then these are just those cards that we all just love. I just love them. I think they're so cool. So um, this right here is going with this kit. Then I have some really, I, I'm sending, I have gotten so much extra little goodies lately that I'm sharing some of my goodies with some people. So, um, with these little kits that I'm doing. I'm trying to uh, put some lace and some, you know, bling in there, some charms. So there's a little dually in here. Um, I'll just open it up and show it to you because that way you know what you're getting. I'll take a picture of it. Here's some um, eyelet lace. I don't know the size of any of these, but they're big enough for you to use embellishments. Um, a little dually, some little applique flowers, dually flowers. Um, this right here, I used um, acrylic paint and made this pink. And then I have some strips of material that I bought uh, a while back. And these are so cool, I love them. And you can use them so many different ways. You could tea dye it, you could cut it in another strip and use it as a tie. You could sew it on pocket. I mean, it's just, that's why I got it because there was like five different kinds of material. So you could sew it in tons of different ways. All right, let's get to the book. Just Here is my little cute book that I did. And um, this is a bag that I have. Um, I think this is the bag. I gotta look at it. I open it up. Maybe an envelope. It's an envelope. I made this out of an envelope. Okay, this is a tea bag on here and I just appliqued um, this Beautiful lady on there and just, you know, add some ribbons, some buttons, sewed around it and, um, oh, I know what this is made out of. This is uh, made out of um, some, I think this is maybe C.J. Christopher's paper that I got from her that she lace dyed. Anyway, it opens up and I did put a little booklet in here and I also um, made a pocket on each side and just cut it down the middle. And um, it's really cute. I sewed this pocket on and have a little card in here. And this right here is a little uh, stamp that I put on there. It says, thanks. Love those stamps. I got them at a garage sale and they're about four or five different ones and they are, oh my goodness, so cute. 
my mother was like, oh my gosh, I love those stamps. So she had to use them whenever we went to the garage sale together. This is some of that Edith um, Holden's paper there. This turned out so cute. I just love the way, I love doing these little bitty um, kits. and I mean, they're not kits, but y'all know what I mean, little journals. And this I used, um, uh, what do you call it? Oh gosh, gauze behind there. This is a real pretty collage. I think this came from Ruby, but I took a copy of it. My mom got, a. a it was like a transfer, and I took a copy of it because I thought it was so pretty. Ruby does such excellent work. I love to watch her videos. A little teacup on there. Kind of got a little teacup theme going on. A little pocket. Beautiful lady right here reading a book. I hope I'm in frame. These are the Harrison Ford pictures here. And I just put some lace inside the middle here. That's probably from a um, curtain. And then here's some of that beautiful paper, um, material that I was talking about that I got. It, I think I bought that at Joann's, but it's been, oh my goodness, six months ago, I bet. Stamped it, little teacup there. Love this right here, that turned out so cute. Got a little side pocket, some ephemera. Lots of journaling spaces. Um, I think you can be so creative on these little books. That's what I like about them because they're just fun to be creative. I love that picture. Here's a little, um, this is actually an actual tea um, container and I just put these little, it says petals in there. These, this is a little tag that I put a teacup on there and let's see, I think this has got something else in here if I can get it. Just a little cute little thing you can put something on if you wanted to. This is a glassine bag and I made this little embellishment on this um, paper clip and this is actually a small glassine bag that's a flip out and I hope I'm in frame. Yes I am but I'm gonna pull it in just a little bit. This is uh, Miss Cog's Crafts. I think that's the ro Rodette the Roses. Um, I have a lot of her um, pictures and stuff that I have bought because they are fantastic and I love using them. Made this little collage up using uh, Laurie, Girl on the Ridge, and how she does her little envelopes. She just tears them and make them. Thought that turned out cute. Another little pocket I made up. And let's see what we got in here. More Edith Holden. A little card I made up. It's cute, backed it, and then these little cards that you can buy. And I did this little collage up here. I thought it turned out cute and sewed around it. But this really turned out so cute and I modge podged over it to kind of, you know, give it some stability. Here's a pocket here. Another one of Miss Cog's um, pictures. So that is the this little um journal that I did up. Okay, on this one, you're going to get these two, uh, this journal here, you're going to get these two little uh, napkins to do some fun stuff with. This is a little uh, bag that I made up. It says, Happy Thoughts. I did this. Uh, this is a stamp that I recently got, and I did some watercoloring on it and just added some beautiful lace here that I got from Sue, and um, she, I won one of her challenges, and she sent that to me, so I used it. I tea dyed it, which it wasn't tea dyed, but I did it because I'm I like tea dye on my stuff. And then this right here too is something that a little applique that I put on there, and then I just stamped on the back. These cards right, here, these little um, um, bags I got from I think Amazon. Here's some more of those pretty note cards. Beautiful. Love the way that tea dyed up um, picture. And this right here is a little card that I made up. Um, this lady, I just did some embellishing on it, put this button on here, and just kind of did a collage on here and did some sewing around it. And then this beautiful lady right here that I did. Look at that tea dye. Oh. And so here's this. It's um, a little bottle cap 
thing that I made. I put some um, paper in there and I did some Mod Podge over it. And you can take and glue that down or can put a magnet on it, just whatever you want to. Some pretty um, pearls here, some pink ones, a real pretty doily that you can use, some really pretty green, um, oh, I don't think you want that, fuzz, green um, lace here that I have and some of that beautiful um, strips of fabric that I have. So that's all going with that. So let's look at the book. This is another small book that I made up. I used one of my paper towel rosettes. I had this little rosette on the top, got a little cart cut out, and um, I did some embossing on this. And then I Mod Podged over it, and it's got this um, ribbon, this um, seam binding ribbon on it. Opens up here, and we have a little pocket on the side that I did up with these beautiful little sayings, a door, rose, um, postcard, just a beautiful picture of some roses. And let's see what we got here. Another one of these little pictures here. Harrison Ford pictures that I did up. And then this right here is actually a envelope that I took and put in the middle. And I made pockets out of it and sewed it on. I've got some little bling here on the middle of it. And did use some of my music paper that I recently got. Uh, these little... Um, embellished paper clips here. My mother actually made these. Oh, she forgot she even made them, but I said, yeah, you did. She was looking at my stuff the other day. So I used those because I thought they were so cute. She made these out of um, coin wraps and embellished them up. So they are so cute. She did a good job on them. I like the way they turned out. All right, these open up and I did some stamping on the inside and really pretty um, collaging on both of them. A bunch of different stuff. And then we have in here, I have um, this beautiful picture here that I backed. This one here. Um, this paper here that's really pretty. This is a little book here that I made up. And just kind of did some, made it up and look really vintage looking on it. It's got some hymnals in there. Just kind of added a little bit of everything on it. Another one of those little sayings says thorn. And so, and that's a little writing in the back. Okay, and on this one here, let's see what we got in this one. Okay, this one's got another one of these little, uh, put some book paper on the back and did some sewing around it. And this is just some beautiful uh, scrapbook paper that I had teabied up that really, really did good. Let's see, and then over here, this is another little collage I made up. Some more of these little words, it says love, rose garden, this um, cute little, I did some lace down here on the bottom and did a, the backing on it and sewed around it. Then I got this beautiful paper here that I tea dyed and it's good for journaling. So this is gonna be my Etsy store too as soon as I get my pictures taken and everything. But by the time this, this video's up, it'll all be in my Etsy store, so. Hopefully, I can get it done in the next few days. Thank y'all so much for watching. I appreciate all y'all's lovely comments and for subscribing to my channel and for helping me out. Y'all have a blessed day.